subscribe to cooking and travel by dr papure borua and press on the bell icon for all notifications <music>
and now I am just going to code them properly and if I do this that is if I repeat this and before I actually dip them into the batter they the batter is going to stick onto the prawn so this way this is the first step the second step is that I'm going to put it here like this and dip in now you can see how beautifully it is sticking onto the sides properly so it's not going to come out because of this uh, dry layer that I've put in the next thing I need to do is that throw in some I'm using it for the extra crunch there this is the breadcrumb you're going to just take it and then coat it in the breadcrumb and then throw in into the pan so this is how it will work heated a white bottomed pan and I've just put in some water, uh, some oil as much as needed to really fry my prawns very well you can look at the prawns there look at them they are so nice look at the the, the coat there is sticking on very well because after all I'm oh, look at that so I've dropped in the prawns there and now you need to do it on slow flame and then just let it cook properly. You can see how well the prawns are coated in the crispy outer layer. So, next thing you need to do is turn them over so that both the sides get properly cooked. Turning them over so that they are cooked properly. You have to do it on medium flame. Remember, medium low to medium flame. So that till the core it is cooked very well. Be patient. Let it be crisp and nice. These have been cooking for almost 6 to 7 minutes. And I am very, very concerned that it has to be cooked to the core. And while the other batch is still waiting, I am concentrating on this. That is just letting it take all the time. So that it can really really cook very very well when that's cooking i'll just take some of the remaining amount of flour in a small bowl and just make a slurry out of it just add in some water and you'll get your slurry this is what's going to help me while i use the spring roll dough sheets so this is ready the better not better the slurry liquidy uh, flour and salt this is the spring roll sheet they come like this here are in this you got around 20 sheets there i've taken one of them and just take the prawn and then give it very softly you do it and you turn it over like this roll it the idea is to roll them properly very slightly meanwhile just heat up a pan round bottom pan with some oil so that it dips into it so and put in the slurry there and just give it a turn and use it like a adhesive there and this is going to be fried now so the oil is heated up I just softly throw in this this will not take time at all just a minute or so turn it over and then we are done so I've turned it over very softly and now just see that entire thing is fried up properly we have this beautiful golden color on the top and see it's a beautiful color on the top and now they are done this way I'll repeat for the entire lot so these are ready my golden fried prawn spring roll look at how crispy the sound don't you think you can imagine the crunch in your mouth when you eat them I hope you like this recipe of mine. Do give it a like and a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't. Thank you so much for watching.